Morning, John. Morning, Roger. How you doing? Now, I know your number one concern is safety. That's right. When it comes to doing tree work, safety is paramount. In fact, the safety concerns for this job started last week when we got in touch with our local uh, utility contractor to help us cover up the power lines. I was actually here where they came. They came with two insulated bucket trucks. Their guys had on all the safety gear, and they actually worked on the wires while they were live. They put on that yellow protective covering. It snaps together and protects up to 7,000 volts. That's right, Roger. And it's actually, it's very helpful, but it's just uh, a little bit of extra insurance. We still want to make sure that we stay as far away from those power lines as we can. John, I know you notified the neighbors. That's right. Yesterday, we notified all the neighbors, let them know what we'd be doing today. Yeah, you kind of have to with all the equipment you have here. That's right. We want as much room to work as possible and to have as few people as possible around us while we're working. We have a chipper and chip truck. We have a 75-foot all-wheel drive bucket truck. And the star of our show is a 110-ton all-terrain crane. This crane has 164 feet of live boom, a 63-foot jib, and it's actually able to pick trees at 170 feet away. Wow. Now, it seems like a bucket truck would be used in most cases to do a job like this, but the crane is a perfect fit. That's right. Um, you can see we're using the crane to lift the pieces and bring them away from the house and the power lines and the telephone poles. Um, if we were using a bucket truck, we'd be lowering those pieces down right in the area where the hazards are. Since we're using a crane, we're able to lift them away from the hazards and set them down behind the chipper where it's safe to work. What would maybe be a two to three day job is, is an easy one day job using a crane. Wow, that's pretty expedient. It really speeds things up. So the bucket truck works in tandem with a crane. That's right, so the way it works is the crane boom will be above the trees and it will lower down um, a nylon sling and that nylon sling will be attached by the bucket operator to the top of the tree. Then the crane will put some tension on that nylon sling and the bucket operator will then move himself down and get into position to make a cut. He'll then be able to get out of the way. The crane at that point will actually lift up the tree and swinging away from the work zone into um, an area where it can be processed by the chip crew. So it's still amazing to me, instead of seeing a tree fall over, to see a tree fall up and get laid down. Now with the tree on the ground, you're ready to process it. That's right, so what they're doing now is they're cutting the branches off of the big piece on the top of the tree, and then they're grabbing it with the grapple, lifting it up, and putting it into the hopper of the chipper, and it's uh, going in as wood, coming out the other side as chips. Well, how big a log can you take? That chipper will actually take a 22 inch hopper. Wow. And what happens to the wood and the chips? Some of the bigger wood, anything over 22 inches, will be sold off as firewood and the chips will all be used in biomass. The bigger pieces that don't go through the chipper will be lifted with the log truck and taken off site with that. So with the trees removed a safe distance away, we can start the stump grinding? We have a machine that has a big wheel on it and that wheel has big carbide teeth. And so what we're doing is we're lowering that wheel into the stump and moving it back and forth and basically pulverizing that stump. The end result will be a hole in the ground you can fill that with loam and grass seed, and it'll be like the tree was never there. Works for me. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.